Welcome back. Cherie and Lucretia are here this morning to talk about their upcoming empowerment mixer this weekend. Thank you ladies so much for stopping by this morning. We are so excited to be here. Yeah, Thank you for having us. brave in the cold. You. We appreciate it. <laughs> yes. So empowerment. Tell me a little bit about uh, kind of the vibe at this uh, mixer this weekend. Well, it got started um, by me doing a photo shoot last year of a lot of the women entrepreneurs here in Tyler because California isn't the biggest state with female entrepreneurs. It's Texas. Really? So yes. So I wanted to do something to showcase the female entrepreneurs here in East Texas and we've just kind of been going from there doing different things in the community showcasing everyone. Yeah. So kind of tell me what it means to be a boss, you know, kind of run your own thing. So what it means to be a boss is to take con control of your purpose, your life, your dreams and aspirations, to uh, do your best and become the best version of yourself. So becoming a boss, whatever that may be, whether that's in the industry of beauty and fashion, whether that's on your job, in your career field, your professionalism, just becoming a boss and persevering, taking back your power, being strong and, and doing all that you can do to inspire other people. Yeah, so who are some of the people that are going to be speaking at the event? So, myself, I will be on the panel. Uh, I am a business owner as well as uh, Lucretia. She's a makeup artist here in Tyler. We have uh, our manicurist, uh, Rashida Adam Otterberry. She'll be on the panel as well as two daycare owners, local daycare owners, Andrea Smith and Lakeisha Price. And uh, we have a published author, Brittany Stanton. She'll be on the panel as well as a uh, realtor, Deborah Jones. And she'll be on the panel as well and we, and we do have two hairstylists mm -hmm. that are here in Tyler with their own shops uh, that will be on the panel as well. A strong group right there. Yeah. Yes. Got like every <laughs> background so obviously it's not easy to be a business owner everybody would do it right so what are some challenges that you ladies have faced as trying to do? Well sacrifice you sacrifice a lot you sacrifice your time time with your family um, time with you know your friends you know doing things that you normally used to do to have a good time or just you know live your life but you sacrifice time it's late nights it's early mornings it's all of that you, you sacrifice everything going hungry sometimes because <laughs> you forget to eat but it's 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 been it's been hard it's, it's different challenges kind of what's the the reward like why is it worth it to you Oh, it's not just the money it's you know helping others it's inspiring you know other people you know I get a lot of my clients are as what I say makeup virgins and they don't wear a lot of makeup and once they do because I do pretty much a unnatural subtle look you know it makes them feel good you know I've had husbands to call me and tell me you know <laughs> next date night <laughs> we're gonna get you to do her makeup <laughs> again so I mean it's it's really the look on your clients face once they get ready to leave you yeah, what advice do you guys have for people maybe that are aspiring entrepreneurs? So the advice that I would give is to just follow your heart, follow your passion, follow your purpose, and don't give up. Continue to press through. There's going to be challenges. There's going to be obstacles. There's going to be distractions. But you must continue to keep your why in front of you and allow that to uh, keep you motivated. Yes. Where can people find more uh, information about the event this weekend? So we have some information on Facebook. You can follow us on Facebook, myself or Lucretia, and you can purchase tickets at the door or you can go to Rockstar Nails on Gentry Parkway here in Tyler or here at Glory Studio to pick up tickets. All right. Thank you all so much for stopping by this morning. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Good luck this weekend.